What's up, YouTube? P-Town Piper here. Uh, you might be a little off. I got the sun right walking out on me. It might be a little bright, but I uh, just wanted to talk about my tobacconist real quick and how cool he is. And uh, you know, if you're ever in Portland, um, you, know, you need to hit up uh, 82nd Avenue Pipe and Tobacco. It's on 82nd and like a block north of Stark Street. Dude's freaking awesome. I was in there earlier, uh, bought a cigar. It was a Steel Cubano uh, Lancero. And I started smoking it, and the thing was just not smoking. You know, I just couldn't get any smoke whatsoever. I even took the draw poker, which, you know, any experienced cigar smoker's not gonna mess around with the draw poker, but I did anyway, you know, just to see if, you know, if I could open it up a little bit. And, Tried it to no avail. Still wasn't smoking at all. And right as I was going to put it out in the ashtray, uh, or actually I left it sitting in the ashtray smoking. I went and bought another cigar. It was a uh, La Gloria Cubana, uh, with the Wavell Natural. Oh, dude, make up your mind, fool. Shit, dude just got in the turn lane and then decided he was going to come back into the straight lane. Didn't realize I was right next to him. Anyway, um, bought that already and had already lit it up. And the owner came by and he saw, you know, he saw me. He's like, "Hey, do you know what, what happened with that uh, Lancero?" And I told him, you know, it's just not, you know, wasn't smoking. It was a dud. And he's like, "Oh, really?" And uh, he walks over to the humidor, grabs another one, walks back over to me, and then hands me a replacement. Couldn't believe it. Yeah, he handed me a replacement cigar. For a dud. I mean, a dud's just luck of the draw. You know, you get a cigar, it doesn't smoke right, and it's just luck of the draw, you know. You're SOL. Go buy another one. But, you know, I guess the guys just, you know, got better business practices than most and decided that he was going to uh, give me another one. I thought that was pretty cool. I don't know if it's because I'm a regular. I don't think so. I think it's just because he's that nice of a guy. But yeah. Just wanted to tell you guys about that. I thought that was kind of cool. Um, kind of want to know if anyone else has ever had that happen. Uh, specifically, um, being at the cigar lounge, you know, because I'm sure, you know, if I took it home and smoked it and told them about it, you know, which I wouldn't, but anyway, I'm sure it would have been different circumstances because, you know, I was smoking it there in the lounge. But uh, yeah, just wondering if that's ever happened to anybody. And if so, I mean, like, did the guy work in there? Did the owner work in there see you? You know, did he know that it was a dud, that, you know, you just got a dud and did he replace it or not? All right, guys, just wanted to get on and talk about that for a little bit. Um, I'm almost to my destination, so I'll end it here. Uh, P-Town Piper, signing out. Peace, y'all. Sweet smokes.